hell's going on in here? Come on, let's get out of here. Tag team time here on the NWA main event. But what about what just happened with the Angels and Chris Gatlin? The Angels proposition and Gatlin, he telling them no. And then Penelope screaming no for some unknown reason. Lone Star runs over and attacking Gatlin from behind, slamming him into that wall. Chris learned the hard way. Like I said earlier, I was out with the Angels last night. And they, when they say no, they mean no. Back in the ring, we've got Dante and Steve Bragg taking on Gypsy Joe and Jason Nesmith. You know the story and history between Gypsy Joe and Dante. They're not even waiting here. It's Bragg with a big right hand behind the head of Nesmith. Let's go back to Joe and Dante. Dante rolling out of the ring, trying to get away from Gypsy Joe. You know what he does with that shovel. And now just taking it to Dante, ramming his head into that apron and then right into the speakers at the Inferno Bar. Now he's taking Dante, where's he going now? He just threw Dante out the door and it's falling him out. Gypsy Joe outside now with a, with a two by four right across the back of Dante and hit him in the gut with it. These two outside here of the Inferno Bar. Oh, nobody, somebody needs to move that red car. As Do Joe just right after Dante, there's a chair outside, picks it up, just nails Dante in the back with the chair, Sean. Can you imagine what's gonna happen tonight when they wrap the ring with chicken wire? These guys are gonna be bleeding all over the place. Bragg now coming out trying to take the chair from Joe and he just nails Bragg with it and Cannibal Lecter with the chair. Once again, Joe taking it to Dante, taking him down the, the alleyway here in Murfreesboro. Looks like Joe's running out of steam here. Those chair shots didn't look too hard. Uh-oh, here comes the trash, nope. He's picking up a pipe. Oh, he hit him right, a, right in the booty with a pipe. That definitely will give you some spine problems later that's, on. That's gimmick infringement on booty call. Two by four to the back there of Bragg and Cannibal Lecter. And I think you're right. Joe's getting tired here and that trash can enough to take him down. Now Dante with that two by four hitting Joe with that injured arm. He's working on that elbow of Gypsy Joe that was injured a couple weeks ago by Steve Bragg. You can see referee Michael White trying to stop this, but he's just out of control. I think we, meet, we might need to call the police on this one. Just choking him right in the alleyway here of the Inferno Bar. Bragg stomping away on Joe, and there's Cannibal Lecter. And Joe, the hardcore legend, but how, how much can this guy have in his tank, especially oh. when his head's getting rammed into the dumpster? I don't even know who's going to be able to stop this. We might even have to bring everybody out of the locker room to, to save, save Joe here. Joe's still getting rammed right into that dumpster. Now take a Dante. Going to ram him head first into the dumpster. So you've got three on one basically going on, and Joe taking it to all three of them. Oh, as you mentioned earlier, that red car is going to get thrashed. I wouldn't be surprised if Joe doesn't pick up Dante and throw him through the, wind, the window there. Nell and uh, Bragg and Cannibal Lecter still going after Dante. You know the storied history between Gypsy Joe and Dante. Everything that's been going on, and Joe's going to dump him in the dumpster. He's taking out the trash, and there goes Dante in the dumpster. That can't be safe, Lee, because of all the bottles that are in there. It can't be sanitary either. Is Joe looking in the dumpster at Dante? And look at Lecter pulling him by his hair, trying to pull him out of there. There comes Dante up out of the dumpster now. Trying to fight Joe through the hole of the dumpster. Both these guys look totally exhausted from the weeks of battles, like last night's Indian strap match they had in Nashville. Joe and uh, Dante, of course, yes, having that Indian strap match. Joe winning last night, but then the aftermath with Cannibal Lecter and Dante beating the fire out of Gypsy Joe. Joe's looking for revenge here. Is now just taking it to him. Still got Dante in that guard in the the, the uh, dumpster. Excuse me, trying to pull him out of there now going to pull him off on the street. Joe don't care where he fights. Joe's going to take it to him anywhere he can find him. Joe definitely the living legend, the true living legend out here in Nashville. Look at this, somebody trying to get out of the way, running back into the building. As he's now, now taking him up on the top there. Now taking that two by four. Oh, right across the stomach of Dante. Oh, there's one to Steve Bragg and Joe leveling everybody. And Joe's still taking it to Dante here. As he's walking over to him now, both these men beating the fire at each other here at the Inferno Bar in Murfreesboro, Tennessee. Walking him over now, there's people all around here, don't know what's going on as Joe just gets rammed smooth into the, I mean Dante, excuse me, smooth into the side of the building. Joe over to him, picking him up, I think he's gonna go for it one more time. Dante right into the side of the building as he hits the pavement hard. And Joe now grabbing Dante. We got some help out here now trying to break these two up. What's going to happen tonight in Columbia when chicken wire is wrapped around the ring? Nobody can escape from this. Gypsy Joe and Dante, there must be a winner. The entire NWA main event locker room clearing out, trying to break these two up.
and Joe just breaks three. Look at him going after Dante one more time, jumping through the crowd here and just fighting back and forth here in the parking lot. Both these men will face off tonight in Columbia. There must be a winner. There must be an end to this tonight in Columbia. NWA Main Event Wrestling, back where it belongs, Nashville, Tennessee, at the Boys and Girls.